ancestor these neutral objectives. This time, level four, it should be Vincent who has a bit of an advantage when it comes down to neutral objective contests. Fans are cooking. That's not something we see. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. What? Whoa. Again? That's a reroute for Yowie, two games God. in a row. He has a, a way with his orange buffs, man. It's like he's the orange buff whisperer. Mm -hmm. He is. Oh, good power charge here, and take a look at this setup. All and three resources there burned from the side of Aura. Did you? Oh my god, you didn't even let him like rotate properly. He's cosplaying the late night shift security guard, just closing out all the entrances in the mall, man. Oh, it's boy. so annoying. Does he do it again? No, no, Purple Buff doesn't want to get rerouted. Oh, he steals it! Oh, this oh. time, Yaoi finds the Purple Buff, and Vincent now, the dinosaur, will have no buff. Let's see, though. Oh. Daytona's welcome, finds one, but the turtle will call me secured by the side of Aura. And will they fight? Seems like the answer is yes, and Vincent will be the first one to fall. Mars looking for a trade, but with the Ooh. flicker, Yowie is still there, still in the land of dawn, and it's actually Cars who will be punished. So he's sacrificing, back to that point, right? So he's sacrificing his lord damage for more sustainability, yeah. practically. That's, there's the Daytona well, Daytona's welcome. On oh. towards just Yaoi though, the re-engage oh. with Hiroki and the wild charge! On towards three, that will secure D in the process. Now Vincent running for the hill, terrified, but the damage will not be enough to take him down. Oh Lord, 21 minutes in, an end angle from Aura. Oh, good stun, good purify by D. But it seems like now Rebellion will lose Audi, who has the immortality. Now let's see, Aura, they were, are going to advance more, and the base will be the main target. Hey, Red Dragons, what's for dinner? They answered the Blue Bulls. To the back, trying to deal more damage to Kabuki, but he's able to actually get out. Wow, Sans gets Chung Yaoi, oh. 1 HP. Early gets out, he has the wild charge, he wants to go for initiation Run. before he dies, perhaps. Around in the back, flickers out of the last insanity boots. Right there, oh, in the bottom lane, Albert finds a kill. Yaoi and Gugun, very low. Ron as well, they need to find some compensation here with a 4v3. It's still Onik who are winning this team fight. Yaoi with the wild charge, connecting on the two members. Gugun, now pinned down, but still is able to secure the turtle. It's Ron in the back, going for the stun. Gugun with the taunt, now Keyboy jumps to the vengeance. Pulled back, but I'm offended. Overrun, don't run Wolf King onto the back. Now it's gonna be Keyboy, who will be taken down Sons. by Ron. Sons has finally joined a team fight now with the last insanity and the chaos assault. It's also a turret down below going down. Aran against three. Natural Echo, Sans 1 HP gets out with the brilliance. Yeheskiel, we're going to ask for oh, the wall God. down to stop him from getting out, to deal more damage for Yeheskiel to execute him. Down here as well, because Keyboy is not there. He's going to bait out the heavy spin first for Kyrie. All oh, Braga armor. Already gonna be taken out here. Ooh. Wild charge not connecting. A good snipe down. Sans slow. Oh, oh, no. Finds the killing spree through the minion waves. Now it's Kyrie who's looking for the seal. Google. No Appraiser's Rat Retribution. Okay. Yaoi also in the front trying to zone them away. They have the zoning. Meanwhile, Yaoi looking for something. Up to the conceal, but Lord actually stops that play from happening. Keyboy. Connor, I'm offended. Able to flicker out the safety. Meanwhile, Yowie, oh. three man set with a wild charge. Now flickers out the safety. Meanwhile, Good. the back line. Gugun, appraiser's rat. Now pinned down. Sans, chaos assault. Kabuki's on the killing spree. Now chasing down Albert. Gugun on the other side of the map right now. Trying to survive with MP Rage. He gets oh. out of dash. One hit away. And Aran's chasing them out as well. Gugun's still 1 HP. Oh. Not just able oh. to survive. Oh. Gugun, my goodness. As Oh. Now, ooh, Boots, and I'm offended this time with the Kyrie on to Boots as well. Conceal, Keyboy, wild oh. charge by Yaoi, forcing a purify. Three man taunt at the final slash. Ooh. Boots gonna be taken down as Yaoi dives deep with the brutality. Kyrie pinning down Aran. Sans, very low, taunted up. Gugun stabs him and takes him out. It's a three for one in favor. Out there, Gugun. Stun lock. Oh, Gugun turns it around onto Kyrie. Appraiser's oh. right. Oh. Holy oh. damage! Portal coil defensively from Kai. Now with a flicker oh, oh, oh. over Gugun though. So able to survive for a bit or run now. Dealing damage back onto Onik. But Onik, they pick Gugun up. They take him down. A oh. One last shot from Yeheskiel from downtown. Four. So the pre-level for Power Spike is no longer at play. But look at this. With the hard guard of the vengeance and the damage from Yeheskiel too. Both of them got melted down by Oran on the CC. Kyrie jumping forward with a mortal coil. Oran has a Braves Mind, has a sustain, has the damage though. It's Kai who just Decimates him. We have the right composition. Aran is doing everything right now with the help of the hard guard. Now onto everybody. He has the vengeance, so he is very, very tanky. He has a brave smite as well. Blue though, bringing him back all the way to the back. No decimate just yet from Kyrie. Oh, no he's out of way. range. Aran is actually going to be surviving here because he's hitting onto the 
Eternal Guard, Boots has to flicker out and Aura get a free turtle. Boy. Earlier, key boy. Final Slash is ready. Jumps Ooh. in, gets a Final Slash on the Kabuki as well. Force him to purify as now. It's Google in the midst of it all with the Appraisal. No connecting on the Zon, surviving for such a long time, dashing out. In no but way. The glue is still on him. Keyboy jumping in, in. Goku no way. survives again with the healing, the impure rage, the sustain built in his kit. Highly revealed boots as well. Chunk down now. And Astro Meteor. Oh, Keyboy oh. fights it. Head steal the back. Brings wow. it towards the team. Kyrie picks the kill up now. Aran chasing them down. Using the ultimate what? to tie him up. But it's not enough damage to take him down just yet. Split split by Boots to get him out. Kabuki walking up forward. Oh no. Brought back. Lazy to wet now from Albert. Cancelled out instantly by Gogun. Who's now chunked as well. The Flask of the Oasis doing work. Gogun getting out to safety. Trying to look for the sustain back at it again. As Aran looks for an angle to get back in. But he doesn't have the hard guard. Good, good. We're going to steal. Jumps in with a taunt now. On to Kyrie. Mortal Coil is right there. The Prince is wrong! Oh! Oh! But Keyboy gets the Lord. Albert got big bumped over in that team fight. Fired. But Aura are holding on to the Lord really, really well. Angela still up top around now. Dashing forward. Onto the back. Onto Sans. Still going to be mobilized. Oh my god. Albert almost got taken oh, down. Keyboy finds the steal. Against all odds, Kyrie is the one who gets taken down, though. Boots is next on the chopping block. Oran, with the help of the sustain, my goodness, cannot die. It's kind of, it's favoring Aura for sure in the bottom chapter. Oh, the far lane for sure. Yeah, Heskill picked off what? by a final slash flicker instantly with an internal guard. And now Aura are the ones on the back foot. It's the Sky Kings who strike first. In this Lord fight, Gugun walks up onto Boots. Hard guard ready. Gugun gonna be melted down by Sans. The first damage beam on the back line. Oran jumping forward. Albert very, very low. Pops in a blaze into it. Final slash to peel him away. But Albert has immortality. Buys it just in time. Oran still walking back again with the split split. Onto Albert. 1 HP again. Albert still able to outplay Kabuki. Oh, One last shot is all he needs. But he gets sword no. away. Oran in the midst of it all finds Albert. But is it worth it? They've delayed the Lord. They've gotten Kyrie low. Three for one. I don't know. This might be the chance for Onik to retaliate. Kyrie is very, very low. Kabuki, do you want to go for this? This is a Hail Mary play if he goes for it, but the risk is very great. They have the hard guard too. It's 2v4. Kabuki trying to melt them down. Now the final splash and the split split also onto him. Slam time pass pass. That's it. Coming down. That's it. That's oh, another shot God. over. Kyrie's oh. one. He still gets out. Yeah, Hesky with a flicker forward. Finding the Astral Meteor Woo. onto Kyrie. To his own base. Another shot over to the midst of Onik. Oran poking him down from the side. No siege, like you said, short range on Kabuki. Finally gets an opportunity to go for it. Oran caught in the final slash. Pops into vengeance. Onik back down! Oh, it's a shot from Yeheskill! Guard, what are they gonna do about it? Over to Albert. Oran is actually pinching him down. Albert's oh, gonna get knocked down. Yeheskill! Threats the needle! It's a final slash to the back right now, but Kabuki is still in there in the team fight, spacing perfectly. Boots is down. Kabuki is unstoppable. Sans gets shot. He buys the immortality. Keyboy fighting for his life in this match. The dragons fly high, they burn the Sky Kings down! They tear the reign of Onik! It does rely on Aran to make some of those flashy plays happen. But it looks like he was able to get a lot of gold on that shield turret. Will that make a difference? Oh, Yaoi? Dikundo on the flicker right now! Oh, oh my god! A catastrophe struck! It's Key with a flicker while charged to the wrong side! Moreno goes for Enchanted Talisman. So, we'll see what that does in this team fight. A wild charge, two red trees, and it's the mage who picks it up. Now, Key caught on the big bonk. Still able to disengage for a bit, but Yeheskill goes in, and that's an amazing pick from Yaoi. Kicks Moreno back into the team with a Petrify, and a, a final blow to the back. Lord JM flickers out the safety. It does give him a little bit of an advantage, as both teams are going to center around the next neutral objective. Key and Yaoi, though. Away the dragon, over to Key again. Another wild charge stolen away by Yeheskill, and the lockdown. Kabuki shreds through him. Him. Not against me today. You're seeing it again. Aura, when they go for skirmishes, they win it out. But Bigatron, they have to go for a proper team fight to actually come out on top. Good shield in the but Chun Poo is still there. Eternal Guard peeling for Super Cam. Kabuki is doing so much damage. Wild Charge in the back. He has skill doing the same thing, but now going to be blocked down inside the range of the turret. Lord JM, a DPC for the team to kite away. Goku's 1 HP, but he doesn't die. Not yet. He is still able to get out for a bit. And man, there's a lot of damage. Oh, part two. Jumping onto Iman, trying to cut away again. And Aran again is able to slice his way over to take Iman down. It's, what, it's what's making Bigatron just doubt themselves 
and they're not playing as decisively as they usually do. Yaoi is. Way the dragon over to Lord JM. Gonna be melted down with wild charge. Stuns up two. Now a penalty zone onto two, but in the back line is going to be Iman, who tries his best to deal damage. Aran deletes Moreno. Now into the back. Again with the final blow. Gets out, zones them away. Aran is doing so much work. Still for Bigatron, especially when there's no route to flank in the back line, but Yaoi over to Keep with Wave the Dragon, now melted down instantly, no wild charge in the back as well, it's going to be around who tries his best to do and utilize the final blow, getting the final slash as well. And allowing Aura to flank them instead, but now they backed away and they allow oh. Aura some time, oh! A wild charge and a flicker over to Iman and Kabuki's right there to pick up the scraps and Key as well, gonna be locked down and taken out, Kabuki shredding through them. Lord JM is next, it's a triple kill, Yaoi! Oh, yeah, he goes to the Jiku, no, just a flicker, he doesn't even have the way of the dragon. It's all just a disrespect, the eternal guard comes in, a big bonk. Aura, the red dragons, they're going in, they're going in hot. Super Ken, Dragon Lord over the mid lane. Moreno in the back, now with the Eternal Guard. Gonna be stunned up with Eye for an Eye, and the Petrify as well! The base wide open, no minute just yet, but now with the Mount spawning in, it will not be enough! Aura makes quick work out of BTR in Game 2 to force a third game in this series. Where Barats really shine. Oh, Flicker Dog come on towards Sua. Boy will be taken out. Good transformation on towards Beloy, but it seems like the damage will not be enough to take him oh. down. And never mind. Good gun. Wow, what uh, coordination there. On top side, Shaman Force pops. Who can picks up a boy? Let's see. Implosion misses. Flicker oh. by Yaoi will secure Beloy. And let's see here. Chedera will not be able to cover as Good gun picks up the double. Will not be looking for the triple. Oh, that's, that's a wasteful implosion there. Even Yaoi now. Looking for oh. him. Three man knockup as well. Primal Wap form. Take a look at the back side now. Right. Razor in the front side what? though. We'll oh. take some heat. Iran. It's a five oh. man rotation here. Four man rotation with oh. Ivan Olin. Iran. Iran will eat Belorski up. We'll oh. take him down as well. The back side. Yaoi will find another, but two members will be taken out now. A boy with the knockup. We'll find the double as oh, well. Boy. That's a good response, but it seems like Kabuki will find the last laugh. That makes oh, a mistake no. during the season. Just Beloy though. Soon as well, Ken Beloy will find the implosion. Finding one, knock up three. But it seems like the damage will be enough to take Hazel down. Beloyski will fall next as Luke, Luke. flickers out, but Gugun collects the double. Warren hasn't done too well in MPLs. See your final blow already popped. Turtle reset it. Hazel now receiving oh damage, but the wild God. charge will lock Hazel down and will take him down by Gugun. Luke now looking for Yaoi, petrified Yowie. and rested. Yaoi looking for an escape under oh. the turret, but it seems oh. like Luke oh. will be able to oh find the L play. Yaoi! 200 IQ, Luke was chasing him like a dog chasing the bone. But Yaoi was so, so sly. Turn flicker away. We'll have the space, but it seems like now Geek will not commit on oh. towards the mid. Flicker wall charge on towards two. The damage, though, will it be enough? Nether Realm committed by a boy. And let's see, let's see. Will it be the recovery? Geek fan, right. reinforcements coming. Luke looking for an escape. Blazing the wet as well in the side Chidera. of the Aura side. Chidera will be taken out. Aura looking for Luke, but it seems like Luke will oh. be able to escape as Google oh. oh. makes sure that he will secure the kill. Finally a 5v5 ensuing. Yaoi is so aggressive with the grok, the wild charges and the flickers. Because he is behind, he is further away from actually reaching the power spike. And Luke hasn't wow. been able to activate the side oh. lanes. Yaoi again! Flicker, wild charge, another round committed. It's a 4v4 now with the hard guard in place. Let's see, a boy and Hazel in the front side of the map. But take a look at Gugun targeting Last Insanity oh with the goodness. help of Yeska will find Maloyski. Now Hazel looking to find the front line, being the front liner, finding the kill Luke, with Luke? the help of Tadera as well. Lulu misses what? the skill, it seems like, and that is one for one. <laughs> See here the Lord, though, actually poked by Geek. Gugun in there Gugun. with the retribution wow. as well. Now, in the collapse, Kabuki with the blazing duet, finding one. Will he be able to find two? Chedera falls as well. Two members taken out as Kabuki secures the double. That's a three, no, two members. It's crazy. They're so behind when it comes to Ooh. items. And again, oh. the v recalls. The spice. <laughs> They have to risk it. With the Enhanced Lord taken, I'm not sure if they can defend. Oh, Flicker, wall charge on towards one. 
but completely. They will not collapse. Oh, Feather Realm committed already. Aram loses his Muraga armor. Oh, take a look at the back side. Oh, oh. committed. Yes, kill. Finding one. Oh, Luke escapes. But now the damage. Chidera flickers. Good winner. But no. Chidera would secure Kabuki. the kill. Kabuki. The back side. He will lose his mortality. Take a look. Is oh, this no. a mistake? As Kabuki will be shut down by Chidera, who finds a double. Yeah, we pops it. Can see an aura. They. This might be a blunder. Light oh, in the end of the tunnel, but a run is yeah. back! Like last decided with the flicker as well! We'll find the shutdown onto Wishadera. Oh. And it seems like they oversay in the mid as Luke will fall as well. It was dimmed down by Aura. Now they're looking for the last member of Geek Fab. Uh, the crystal! Run. And this it's in their eyes! It's seen a boy will not be able to hold on for long as Hazel now in the fray. But it seems like a Heskill will target the base. The and the base will be collapsed. Will be taken now. And Aura Kalina sweeps Geek Fam. Geek Fam falter. That was so, so scary for Aura Esports. That was so close to a blunder. But the light was never there. The hope was never there. Aura is able to close it out in convincing fashion.